stage one of the process, one raw egg and one cup of vinegar. The egg starts to break apart and roll and turn around. This is after 24 hours, the egg starts to expand, breaking down the shell. As the shell starts to break down, it comes off in the vinegar, making a translucent state, and then taking it out, gently washing it. You can see the egg is very rubbery and translucent and can almost see right through it. At this stage, we're gonna take this part of the egg. You could actually bounce this if you wanted to, but we're gonna take this and put it in a glass of sugar water, making it actually shrink. And then after that, we will take uh, food coloring, let that set for 24 hours, and then take food coloring and inject it with a small needle and you'll see the egg expand again. I'm just gonna hold it, mommy. And you can see it float in the sugar water. Now, if you had that in just regular water without the sugar, the egg would actually sink to the bottom. So, what we're doing here is placing an egg, submerging the egg in vinegar, and the shell dissolves. The vinegar contains an acetic acid, which breaks apart the solid the solid calcium carbonate crystals that make up the eggshell into the calcium and carbonate parts. The calcium ions float free. The calcium ions are atoms that are missing electrons, while the carbonate goes to make carbon dioxide. That's the bubbles that you see in the first part of the video. Another thing that you can try is the reaction of the eggshell and the vinegar is an acid-base reaction. Um, a base reacts with the acid in the vinegar to make the carbon dioxide. Bacon soda is also a base. Try mixing the bacon soda and vinegar and see what happens. And you can actually use this mixture to explode like a plastic bag, which is very cool. But if you watch the next video, uh, what we're going to do next is right now we've put a cup of sugar water and we're floating the egg in the sugar water. This will make the egg actually shrink. Uh, once the egg shrinks by tomorrow, um, it'll be down almost to half its size. We'll take it out of that and then we will take plain water uh, with a couple of drops of food coloring and put the egg back in it for about an hour. The egg will start to expand. What I'll also do is take a needle and pull out some of the colored water and inject the egg with the needle with the colored water. What happens is a little bit later, it will start to spew out like a volcano with the colored egg yolk and everything. It's pretty gross, pretty gooey, but it's an awesome activity for four years old, four year olds, and um, just awesome to try it out and try all the different experiments. So check back on the next video. Thanks, hope you enjoyed.